Hi everyone and welcome to your financial read for June 2019. This is for Scorpio and welcome all my new subscribers. Absolutely wonderful. Here we go. Finance, June 2019. May it rain money. <laughs> all right. So I did a little bit of a meditation and a pre-shuffle and I saw an eagle. Look at that. Self-satisfaction and a new start. I saw an eagle flying high and I got the eagle's perspective. Uh, you, the eagle was flying or I could say you were flying over very cavernous rocky hills and down below there was what looked like ants scurrying around. But I realised that they were people. They, you, you were that high up that the people looked like ants. And they were all like a maddening crowd running into each other. It was all this big confusion down below. And you were soaring high above it all. Quite majestically, not flapping a wing, just soaring. So that's how you need to think about your finances at the moment. Be calm and look at it from a really elevated place. The other vision I got to was a, I don't know if anyone's seen It, a terrifying movie about um, a Stephen King movie. That's what I saw, It, and someone in the, um, down in the gutters, down in the um, dorm water, beckoning you towards them. I can think of that movie, it terrifies me. Um, and... Because they were making such a fuss, it got your interest. You came over and had you had a sort of got close enough to realise they, the energy around them was very black, and very low, and you didn't ent you didn't enter into a conversation. You turned your back and you walked away. You had nothing to do with it. So if you find that people are really sprouting a lot of negativity about money at the moment, you might find the news or the mass consciousness is really sprouting a lot of negativity about money, try and disconnect from that. Try and have a higher perspective when it comes to money because uh, I think it could be quite easy to be dragged down that stormwater down into that black abyss and you know in that I don't know if you've ever seen that movie but you'd be lucky to come out you know so you need to really step away from the crowd and the the, the mass consciousness thoughts about finances at the moment and raise your idea and your vibration uh, maybe have a look at the law of attraction when it comes to abundance and stuff like that but it's certainly I think time Scorpio for you guys to Saw solo when it comes to finances, and that doesn't mean just you know drop everything and go off by yourself, it means to, to get a different perspective on your finances, okay? And I think if you do that, you might even pull yourself out from the depths of the depths of the depths down, down subterranean blackness up straight into the heavens. Your whole perspective and your whole finances are, could change literally overnight. Okay. Wow. Okay. So let's have a look at June. Yeah. Could change overnight. Okay. So the Fool and the Star. Brand new start when it comes to putting yourself out there. I think you're going to soar high above everybody else. It's time to make your mark. Don't do what everybody else is doing. They're all running around like ants on the ground. All right? If you've got a really good idea, go for it. If you feel like stepping out on your own financially, go for it. You're going to have loyal people supporting you. You don't need much information. You haven't got much in your pouch there. You just need to take that first step. Now, you could be terrified of that first step because you could feel like you're about to walk off a cliff. But the universe is saying you're going to fly. There's going to be wings sprouting up the back of you and you are going to fly. So look up. 
Scorpio, look up. Look up into the sky. <clears throat> All right. You are a star. All right. So financially for June 2019, yes, you've got a great idea on how to make money, Scorpio. And if you haven't, it's going to be coming to you. Now you've thought long and hard about this, even though the page is one of the, it's the uh, youngest court card. It's in its initial stages. And it's going to end up being something that's going to grow. This is, this is the down in the um, gutter. This is the down in the gutter vision that I had. Focusing on the three of cups. Okay, not looking at this a new emotional start that's coming at you. You're not even interested. You're looking down. You're looking at you down with your arms crossed. No, not interested. No, no, I'm looking at this. Yeah, time to look up. Look up when it comes to your finances. You are the empress. You can and will sit on the throne of thrones. Have extreme financial bounty around you. If you so wish, this is your choice. She's dripping with bounty in all its worldly forms. Food and sun and fresh air and gorgeous clothes and just bounty in all its forms. Okay, you could also be dealing with a Taurus and or Libra. Or you're, you're just, I feel you're just embodying this. So finances, yes. This confusion has kept you in that gutter, has kept you down in the storm water, okay? The cups, the emotions. You've got to get out of the emotions. You've got to get out of these heavy feelings. You've got to get out of the worry, okay? Take that great leap. Yeah, because if you don't, the universe is going to come in and do it anyway for you. Okay, the universe is going to change things for you if you don't. And this could you just be you going, right, I've had enough of just worrying about money and only seeing lack. I'm actually going to start to think about how absolutely bountiful I am. I'm thankful for the clothes on my back, the, the food in my stomach. Okay, this could come very quickly though. It could be rapid change. So the more you focus... On the negative, that's exactly what you get. The more you focus on the positive, that's exactly what you'll get. You've got a really good, passionate idea. Okay, a passionate spark in your belly. You've got it. You know what it is. All right, you know. And you know it'll make money for you. Okay. Stop looking at those three of cups that spilt... Don't worry about money losses that you might have had in the past. You might have lost money due to past relationships breaking up. Anything. It could have been from your parents right back to childhood. All these emotions, all these emotions flowing around. Get control of your emotions, Scorpio. Getting control of your emotions is going to fix this financial issue. Yes, because transformation is here. This is your card. Death, transformation. There's going to be a very fast and very sure transformation in your finances. Where's your head at? Okay. Where's your head at? Yep. Are you in that down in the gutter or are you soaring high? Okay. The devil... This is what's keeping you down. See how black that is? This is the, the, basically the creature that was down in the stormwater. Having you chained to feelings of lack. Having you chained to feelings of inadequacy. Having you chained to this feeling that you'll never get. That you'll never deserve. 
that you'll never have the money to pay the bills. You won't have enough to support yourself. You're going to be, you know, thrown out in the streets, you know. It might be a good time to just check in with yourself and actually look around and see what you can be grateful for right this moment, okay? Right this second. What have you got around you you can be grateful for? Step out of this darkness. Okay, this, you could be chained here the rest of your life if you choose. But if you have a look at these two down here, those chains around the neck are pretty darn loose. I think if they actually lifted up their hands, they could slip that straight off and be out of there. Put on their wings and fly. Okay. Be the emperor on your throne when it comes to finances. Be the emperor, the empress. Be the king of kings, the queen of queens. Step out on your own. There can only be one emperor. There can only be one empress. That's you. Choose the light. Choose to see your finances absolutely thriving. All right, we're going to have a look at the angels of abundance here. Get some more clarification when it comes to your finances in June. You, you, are, you guys have got a massive opportunity this month to change your finances around and literally overnight. Literally overnight. You're in a point of power that is absolutely astronomical, okay? And it's up to you. No one else is going to do this for you, okay? It's up to you. If you're down in that black gutter and you're hearing this and you think, oh, wait a second, I've been really low, right? Okay, time to drag yourself out of there. Jump off that cliff and fly. All right. Focus on your priorities. You deserve. You deserve it. You deserve every single bit of the bounty that's coming for you. Do you feel like you deserve it? It's something to check in with yourself. Okay. And priorities. Focus on your priorities. What you put your focus on is where you receive your outcome. Where's your head at, Scorpio? to be the name of this video where's your head at all right okay and I'll just see if there's another card come out of here <laughs> uh -huh. wow windfall of abundance Scorpio okay an increase in abundance is arriving in many different forms some of them are unexpected the tower be open to receiving and know that this abundance comes to you to support your life purpose, health and charitable work. Okay, choose this windfall of abundance, Scorpio. Focus on money, pouring into your bank account. Focus on the beautiful things, the food in your belly, the clothes on your back, the bed you have to sleep on at night. Be grateful and thankful for every single thing you have in your life. And the universe will say, oh, they're very grateful and thankful. I'll give them more. If you're down in that dark depths of worry and concern, I'm not going to be able to pay my bills. I don't know where my next finances are coming from. I got divorced and they took all the funds. I don't, you know, I'm always going to be left with nothing. Well, the universe is going to say, right, thank you. That's exactly what you want. That's exactly what you'll get. Okay, windfall of abundance. All right, and I'm going to have a, also have a look at a power thought that can help here. All right, Scorpio, finances, June 2019. June 2019. Really good chance now while we're in Gemini season to actually check in with yourself and see what your thoughts and feelings are about finances. Uh, particularly before the 21st of June, we'll start to go into Cancer. 
uh, and being a sister water sign, you could get very much stuck down, wow, very much stuck down in your feelings and end up in a world of confusion. So now, right now is a really good time to check in with exactly what, where your thoughts are on finances. Do you see yourself surrounded by abundance in the future? Or do you see yourself struggling for every penny to pay the rent, to put food on the table? Okay. All right, so cards are flipping everywhere. <laughs> advice for Scorpio, please. Lots of advice wanting to come through. Or just one card, please. Just one card, please. Advice, thank you for Scorpio when it comes to finances. Thank you very much. And the card is, I claim my power, Scorpio, and I lovingly create my own reality. What do you see for yourself? Okay, financially, what do you see? I ask for more understanding so that I may knowingly and lovingly shape my world and my experiences. Now, literally asking for more understanding is asking for more understanding and having a check-in with yourself and actually catching yourself thinking about finance, whether positive or negative. See if you can catch yourself and see how you're actually thinking and feeling about it. Okay, so that was a little bit, that was a little bit like, you know, lecturous. So I'm actually gonna lighten it up a little bit and I'm gonna actually ask the art oracles some, for some advice here. Great deck, love this, art oracles. Okay, so advice from the art oracles, please, when it comes to work. For Scorpio, for June 2019. June 2019. Okay, when it comes to work, find clarity in clutter. Check in with your mind. Declutter those thoughts. Get pinpoint accuracy on exactly what you're going for. Aim for the big bucks. And I'm also going to use cat gurus. All right, cat gurus. What advice do you have when it comes to work? Finance. The Scorpio, June 2019, please. June 2019. Oop. Hamish McCamish. <laughs> in life, as in golf, you have to keep your eye on the ball. Keep your eye on the prize, Scorpio. Keep your eye on the prize. Go for the big dollars. The universe will bring them very quickly to you if you really focus on exactly what you want, okay, instead of what you don't want. All right, beautiful Scorpio. I'd just like to say thank you so much. And if you'd like to like, subscribe, and hit that bell button, I'd be gratefully appreciated. And I'd just like to say thank you. And Bye for now.